Hey there, I want to share how to use a compressor like a pro mixing engineer, even if you are new to mixing vocals. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to use a compressor to make the vocals sound balanced in the mix, how to make the vocals come alive in the mix, and also how to make the vocals sound fuller in the mix, all using a compressor. Right here, I have two different compressors, a stock compressor from FL Studio and an analog model compressor from Waves called CLA2A, which is a clone of the popular LA2A compressor. There are other types of compressors, but we'll be looking at how to transform your vocals using just these two compressors. When I newly started mixing, it was pretty hard for me to hear compression, okay? So I assume that is going to be the case for a lot of you watching. And to solve this problem, we'll be using this free stock plugin that comes default in FL Studio, you can find it in most DAW, okay? It's a dB meter, it just simply tells you how loud the sound is coming in, okay? And you want it to be at the beginning of your mixing chain, at the very top, okay? Even before any other effect. We're going to use this tool to determine the lowest average loudness level of the vocal, okay? So this will help us set the threshold, okay? To so give us an idea of what the threshold is. So I'm just going to expand this so we can see, you know, more skills. Basically, the bigger it is, the more accurate your reading tends to be okay so i'm going to play the vocal mind you this is before every other effect so i'm going to turn off the compressors making sure it doesn't affect the sound we hear do you ever think of me girl come me chef i think of you yeah the freaky things we used to do na, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. and if i see i miss you like when i see i need you i'm hoping that you feel the same me no want to hug you i just want to love and fuck you in different ways because nobody do me better mad for your matter scat on my daughter spend on my rubber so the average loudness level is somewhere around here, which is around minus 15.2 dB. If you look at the top left of your screen, you see the number right there. Okay, now this is a guide. That's not the exact number. So we're just going to dial this in the threshold right here, minus 15 dB, okay? You could, you know, go a little bit more or less, but I'm just going to 15 um, dB, okay? We're going to be using the FL Studio compressor first because this compressor does just one job. It compresses, it does not add color or character to the vocal okay it just compresses it's very clean transparent compressor now after setting the threshold the next thing to adjust is the ratio right here now the ratio can vary a lot for vocals but if you notice a lot of inconsistency between you know the loudest parts and the quiet parts and you know it's like it's pretty obvious you may want you know a higher ratio okay but if it's not so inconsistent right the difference is not that much you may want you know a, a lighter ratio okay so for this vocal, I'm going to play it. If you look at the peaks right here, you can see some really big heads and some really silent tails. So I'm going to play it so I hear. Do you ever think of me, girl? Call me chef, I think of you, yeah. The freaky things we used to do, na, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. And if I see, I miss you, like when I see, I so I can hear lots of inconsistency, right? Because the vocal keeps coming up and going back down, coming up and going back down. So in cases where the inconsistency is so obvious, simply set it to somewhere around four ratio one, okay? And in cases where, you know, it's less obvious, simply set it to three ratio one. So that's it for the ratio. Now, this is not a rule, it's just a guide. And after setting the threshold and the ratio, we have two more buttons that need to be adjusted. That is the attack and the gain knob, okay? Now, the attack is simply how fast you want the compressor to work when, once the vocals cross the threshold, okay? So I'm just going to set this. Now, typically, you want it to set between anywhere from, you know, 5 to 15 milliseconds. You, most times of vocals, you may want a fast attack time. So I'm just going to set it somewhere around 8 or 10, you know, milliseconds, between 8 to 10 milliseconds, all right? Then the gain, typically when you compress, volumes tend to change. So you can use this gain to either um, compensate for the change in volume, okay? So I'm going to turn it on and then we're listening. Do, uh, na, 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 na. do you ever think of me, girl? Call me chef, I think of you, yeah. The freaky things we used to do, na, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. And if I see, I miss you. And if you're listening, there's not much inconsistency anymore, right? If I turn it off. Do you ever think of me, girl? Call me chef, I think of you, yeah. The freaky things we used to do. And if I turn it on. 
Do you ever think of me, girl? Call me chef, how think of you, girl? The freaky things we used to do. Na, 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 yeah, yeah. You can hear how, you know, balanced it sounds when I turn on, you know, with the beats. Used to do, uh, na, 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 na. do you ever think of me, girl? Call me chef, how think of you? So I'm just going to increase the gain knob a little bit so that the vocals can come up in the beat, okay? Do you ever think of me, girl? Call me chef, how think of you, girl? The freaky things we used to do, na 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 so I basically adjusted the threshold a little bit more to compensate. I could still notice some inconsistency somewhere around here, okay? So like I said, if you notice you know, some inconsistency still, you can just adjust your threshold a little bit more, okay? So before we go further into this tutorial, I want to let you know that I have a mixing course, a full-length mixing course that covers how to mix beats, how to mix vocals from start to finish, and also how to master like a pro. So you can click the link in the description if you're interested in getting this course. It's going to break down a lot of stuff in great detail so you can learn by yourself at your own pace how to get much better mixes, all right? So let's get back into the tutorial. So after using the stock compressor, we'll move on to using the CLA-2A, which is a popular choice for mixing vocals, okay? Now this compressor tends to make things sound crispy and punchy. Now when using this compressor, there are two things that I would like you to make sure, you know, you get straight. Firstly, make sure you have this compressor running at about, you know, minus one to minus three dB of gain reduction. We just basically want the tone and not necessarily the compression itself, okay? And so the second tip is try to balance the loudness level coming in and going out. It should pretty much be the same. So you can hear the compression actually working. You want to actually hear if it's actually making vocals sound brighter or snappy or not doing anything at all, okay? So I'm going to adjust this like get about um, minus one to minus three dB of gain reduction. So I'm just going to play the vocal. So I'm going to turn it off to hear if the volume coming in is the same thing as the volume going out. So the volume kind of went down, so I'm just going to increase the gain, you know, to make it a bit louder. So when I turn off the compressor, let's see if you can tell the difference between when it's on and when it's off. Let me solo it, maybe it may help you figure it out this when it's off. Do you ever think of me, girl? Call me chef, how they think of you, girl? The freaky things we used to do. Na, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. And when it's on? Think of me, girl. Call me chef, how they think of you, girl? The freaky things we used to do. Oh, na, 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 na. Do you ever think of me, girl? Call me chef, how they think of you, girl? The freaky things we used to do. So I hope you can hear the difference, right? It's not a big change it's just a small but very impactful change in the vocal after using this compression styles that is the basic compression and then using the la2a for the vocals we'll try using the parallel compression to make the vocal sound fuller in the beat okay and to do that it's pretty easy to do parallel compression to make your vocal sound full thick and good on the beat or in the mix it's pretty easy you have to do just come to your vocals okay send it into an empty insert all right then just let's rename this to parallel. Don't know if, if my spelling is correct. Parallel Vox comp. Then load up a compressor on the empty channel you sent the vocals into. Okay, then exaggerate the settings since 
The CLA tool is pretty much what I'm using, okay? I'm just going to exaggerate the pitch reduction right here, okay? I'm just going to overcompress the vocal. We don't want this for the normal vocals, just for the parallel vocals, okay? And then we're going to just turn it on, and then we're going to blend this parallel comb to fit the main vocal. So I'm going to press play. Think of me, girl. Come and share body. Think of you, yeah. The freaky things we choose to do. Oh, la, 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 la. Do you ever think of me, girl? Come and share body. Think of you, yeah. The freaky things we. When I turn it off. Think of me, girl. Come and share body. Think of you, yeah. The freaky things we choose to do. Oh, la, 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 la. Do you ever think of me, girl? Come. I want to turn it back on. Think of me, girl, come me share body, think of you, yeah, the freaky things we choose to do, oh, la, 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 la. Do you ever think of me, girl, come me share body, think of you, yeah, the freaky things we choose to do, la, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. And if I see, I miss you, like when I see, I so you can hear how the parallel compressor makes the vocal sound right makes it sound fuller and more present in the mix and of course you can blend this to taste there's really no um value i can give you to how much you know you should blend this into it depends on how thick or how full you want your vocals to sound all right so this is how the vocal sound when all compression settings are turned off think of me girl come and share it. think of you And when I turn all compression settings back on, this is how the vocal sounds like. Think of me, girl. Come and share body. Think of you, yeah. The freaky things we choose to do. Oh, la, 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 la. Do you ever think of me, girl? Come and share body. Think of you, yeah. The freaky things we choose to do. La, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. And if I see, I miss you. Like when I see, I miss you. I'm hoping that you feel the same. We don't want to hide you. Do me better, mad for your matter, scatter on my dada, spend on my rubber. Would you let me be up the valve? Mad mose. If you found this helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more tutorials like this. I remain Sir Classy. See you soon. Cheers.